Bonjour, amigos. I had to bring you this story. I haven't made any happies lately, but I put up some videos that have happy things in them. I'm still thinking about what's such a happy thing. This is more of a warning, I'm afraid. It's a warning thing. Um, I was looking in the newspaper here, our local newspaper, called A Ride Down to the Bone. It is a warning. A warning of how easily we just accept everything and they got us to accept so much. Um, in our local area, I live in the Inland Empire, not far from Big Bear, a custom motorcycle is being crafted for a famous mind freak and magic man. And the bike is literally bad to the bone. A local bike shop is putting finishing touches on its seventh custom-made bike for illusionist uh, mind freak. I won't say his name. You know who he is. They call him Angel. One that maker says he is using a real human skeleton dipped in stainless steel as part of the frame. The famous illusionist told the uh, bike maker that he wanted to build a skeleton bike made out of scraps of sheet metal. The owner who owns the bike shop, chopper shop, with his wife Mona said, I told him, why don't we use a real skeleton? He said he knows the operator of a foundry, and the operator was able to get hold of a real human skeleton that could be cast in metal. He says human bones can be purchased and often are used for medical purposes. Seventh custom made bike. It will be kept in his mansion in Las Vegas, made out of a real human skeleton. So anyway, uh, I'm still here, and uh, I'm not, you know, if I'm on the video and I start going like Captain Kirk in a wormhole, it's just our California quake that we're waiting for. So far, we're good. But this, this is not good. We need to really uh, pay attention to how they're conditioning us. I find this to be very, very bad because no one's going to react to the story probably very much whatsoever.